I've unlocked three of the millionaire packs from Team Affinity. You could get a million stubs out of this thing. I'm about to open all three of these bad boys, and by my math, that means I'm halfway through the Team Affinity programs. Or I'm halfway through half the teams. Currently, I'm over 50% in four out of the six divisions, and I'm only 10,000 points away from having a fourth millionaire pack from the NL East. Along with that, we have a headliner pack, 27 standards, three ball as a habit packs, and what do we have here too? Eight Team Affinity packs, Team Affinity Diamond packs, and we're making monster upgrades to the team now. This is the episode where our team gets good. Why not? Let's start this, let's start this pack opening off with the best packs we got. We get a standard pack in the first one. Two more. Sh show me that voucher. Another standard pack. Okay. Come on. Show me that voucher. One time. Show me that voucher one time. See, look, I know it's asking for a lot, but I haven't even pulled, like, a decent diamond yet. Pulled two chase packs and Edwin Diaz. The team looks pretty good right now, as is, but adding a bunch of 89s like we're about to do is going to be huge for us. So far, there's no one in particular on the team I'm looking to upgrade. We haven't even used the Ryan Howard card yet. Our pitching staff is honestly where we're weak. We could use arms. So let's get into it. I'm going to open these two loose headliner packs first. We got Seiya Suzuki. Did I go past this the first time? Wait, what? What just happened? Did I go? Is that a diamond in the first slot? One and two. Did I did I miss it when I first went past it? And then I auto flipped and there it was. We did get a diamond pull there though. I'll take it. Vibes. One. Let's go. Juan Soto looking really good in those Yankee pinstripes. They got to lock this man in long term. That card looks awesome. I love Juan in MLB The Show. We'll definitely get him some swings. He'll go on the bench. Nice. Let's go. Headliner pack two now. We get a headliner pack number two. <laughs> no diamond in this one, though. Uh, Kodai Senga, who should be a diamond in my opinion. We're not going to talk about that. 27 standard packs. We added two more from those millionaire packs. We get a diamond here. Maybe packs are hot right now. Maybe this is just a good time to rip. 4 o'clock p.m. 4 p.m. a good time to rip. They fire off the jets after after the update. We get the updates at 3. Cool down time. Rippers at 4 p.m. I'm going to take note of that. 21 more. We get another diamond here. Jersey, 20 more. Royal City Connects, 19 more. We're going to get some more City Connects this season. Phillies. Unfortunately, it looks like they're leaked to Jersey. I would not be a fan of it if that's what it was. The blue and yellow, just not. I'm not a fan, personally. 14 more, 13 more, actually. Ryu, we got a dozen packs. Oh, boy. Packs really have been brutal to me so far this year. The game's been out a week. It's only, it's only been a week. Let me slow down at least a little bit here. But I, uh, I'm usually pack guy. I'm usually pack guy. It's not happening for me this year. They're really making me earn it. Ask and you shall receive. Come on, baby. Show me purple. Oh, my goodness. It's purple again. Ozzy Albies added to the Braves collection for us in the NL East. Four more standard packs now, and then we have three balling as the habit packs. Before we get into those guaranteed diamond team affinity packs. Lando Arcia, one more. Gold Jose Siri and three balls. We got at least three more golds here. Increased chance at diamonds. Zach Allen, one more. Gold David Bednar. Okay. AL Central. Two packs from the AL Central team affinity. Oh, baby. Is there, I was going to say, is there any pitchers in here I absolutely have to take? Emmanuel Classe. We're going to throw Emmanuel Classe in the bullpen. But then that second pack, I already know who I want out of that second pack. One of the best cards in the game right now. Brian Dozier, new legend in MLB The Show. Added him to the roster. We're going to throw him in. I'm actually going to get Kim out of the lineup. We get Brian Dozier in there, who might go in for Tony Stone. Now we got two NL Central team affinities. A.J. Burnett, Yasmani Grandal, Jack Flaherty, 89 overall. Joey Votto, Sammy Sosa, Jack Flaherty. It's an okay card. Grandal, switch hitting catcher this early in the year. 
I think I'm going to take Grandal as my first one. Then my second NL Central Team Affinity Pack. I don't know if I want this AJ Burnett. 91 control of that sinker, or if I want Jack Flaherty. I think I want to go with A.J. Burnett. He's just got a little bit more pitching disparity. We'll throw him in for Pablo Lopez. Now we have two AL East packs looking for pitching. There's not much in here, and I'm going to take yet another catcher, Gary Sanchez, one of my favorite swings in Diamond Dynasty history right there. One more from the American League East. We got Sean Green, Cedric Mullins, Evan Longoria, and Kevin Euclid. Give me Uke. And we have two NL East packs. Uh, David Justice, Giancarlo Stanton, Vladdy Sr., Billy Wagner, and David Wright. Billy Wagner's an auto snag. Put him in the bullpen for us over Melanson. And then the final pack, another NL East team affinity pack, where I am going to take, I think I want to take Giancarlo. Giancarlo Stanton. And now after that pack opening, I've decided to go through the squad, check things out. And really the only addition to the starting lineup is actually going to be the 89 overall Brian Dozier, who's going to go in DH. I'm going to get this Colson Montgomery in at shortstop as well. I've hit the ball so well with him. I just can't ignore him anymore. The bench is now loaded up though. Juan Soto, Gary Sanchez, Tamar Johnson, Grandal is going to platoon with Ryan Howard. Ryan Howard's going to be at first base with 94, 120 versus right. And then Grandal's going to be on the bench with 74-99 versus left. He's going to be the backup. And I'm going to start A.J. Burnett in a ranked seasons game today in this video, who has 83 hits per nine, four pitch mitts, sinkers is primary. He's got 91 control of that sinker, which is really, really good. I like this team. I have the Team Affinity East Season 1 Conquest map completed. I have the Central map started, and we've began moving around. And then from there, I'm going to jump into the West map, of course. And by then, between gameplay and those map bonuses, we should be pretty close to done the Team Affinity. I even have some exchanges I'm going to knock out. Between the bonus points that you get for those maps and all the gameplay XP that we're going to get with the players, because I do have dedicated lineups for the divisions that I'm working on, we're probably going to be really close to finishing Team Affinity, like this week. I'm going to do damage this weekend. You should grind along with me on Twitch, by the way. It's twitch.tv slash realshelfie. Shoot me a follow. we got got 100k over there. Come join the party. I also told you guys I'm working on the Battle Royale program. I drafted a bomb squad that is currently blurred out on your screen right now. That Battle Royale draft is going to be in a separate video. Look out for that very soon. Here we go. We're going to be the home squad against Jim Spar and his gold live series, Kevin Galsman, that's on the mound. Ooh, he's got the Brave uniforms on. Galsman back in Atlanta. Ground ball shortstop. Colson Montgomery will scoop and throw. Easy one pitch, one out to start the game. We're hitting today, too. Ground ball again. Colson Montgomery is there. Can he make the throw? He can. Bang! I don't think that's an out last year. This is that defensive urgency they were talking about in MLB The Show 24. He comes up with this play super quick, making the decision to throw that over the first. No pause in between. Disgusting stuff from Colson Montgomery in his debut at shortstop. That's not a good changeup, but Colson Montgomery... Makes all three plays. Look at you go, young man. Oh, the belt high fastball. I was anchored just below there, and I missed it. Colson Montgomery going to step in. Man. Josh Gibson grounds out to third. Didn't quite get that heater. That one was well located right on the black. That first one I missed to start the inning, though. That 0 2 curveball. We're just going to go breaking ball. Beautiful pitch. Dylan Cruz will go get that. He inside outs it straight up in the air. One down. Paint. Mwah. You, I, you can get me, but I'm going to get you back. Really good fastball. Jammed him up, popped him up. Ryan Howard will go get it. He's also going to hit here, bottom two. Ryan Howard, perfect, perfect, off a righty, way gone. Do we have a distance marker? 450 pulled Ryan Howard. That's a bonus in pack squads. By the way, go watch pack squads. Go watch pack squads. Ah, that's a bad hanging curveball. One, two, he hangs a curveball out over the plate. I didn't make him pay for it. James Wood steps in now. He's batting 400. I've liked his swing a lot so far. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Hanging curve and a fastball right down the middle. We missed both after we hit a nuke. 
So nuke, bad miss, bad miss. Here's Tony Stone. Chases a slider. Yikes. Tony Stone. Oh, I thought maybe she yanked that one out the left. Not quite. Inning started with a big time swing from Ryan Howard. Then I had two very hittable balls that I missed. We're through two up one. Should be more. Good change up. Flies out to Buxton left center. We got one out in the third. I'll pitch my way through these early innings. We're bound to string a couple. He's just throwing so many strikes. We're gonna have a multi homer. We're gonna have a multi run homer in this game. That changeup got too much played, however. Back to back changeups. He hits that one much better, and we didn't pick it up. Buxton gets a bad animation out there in right center. It's going to move the runner up to third. The tying runs out is 90 feet away right after we score a run. He's looking like he's going to get it back. Nine hole coming up here. Bunting, huh? He thought about it. Not quite, though. He's going to run him back to third here. Not playing any games on the bases. One nothing. Two outs now. Luisa rise up. Change up too much plate. That is not a bad pinpoint, AJ. I need you to be better, brother. An RBI single on Lisa Louisa Rise. I'm not happy with that pitch location at all. I'd be walking out to the mountain right now frustrated. If I'm throwing seeds in the dugout, well, how do we throw a strike right there? Popped up the sinker. I should have went sinker to a rise. He ties it right back up. Let, let's, let's come right back with a headshot. Cranked! Adrian Beltre's got that righty-righty. He's going to lead off the third with a double. Perfect, perfect. Doge! Brian Dozier! Brian Dozier gone! In the nine hole for his first at bat goes yard. Come on, Doge flips the lineup with a nuke. Love to see it. Now here's Byron Buxton. There goes Byron Buxton. Back to back. Get him out of here. Run him out of here. Whoa. That's a 3-1-W for the good guys. Let's jump into a second game. Why not? We're on the road this time against the 89 Brandon Webb. Diamond Brandon Webb. Loopy sinker on Brandon Webb. And he's taking us to Progressive Field in Cleveland. One of my favorite All-Star Game experiences. Got to see Jock Peterson and Vladdy go at it in the Derby. He's 5-2 and two in ranked. Let's make it 5-3. and three. If you want to check out Progressive Field... Use code SHELFIE at SeatGeek for 20 bucks off your first purchase. I See, I just I just hit that breaking ball away really well. That, that, that was a great play by the shortstop. I just hit that breaking ball away really well a few times to end the last game. I tried to do the same thing, but that's just off the plate. Colson Montgomery? Is that going to go? He got 99 exit velo. It's going to hook the foul pole. We're up early. The homers are rolling right now with the boys. Colson Montgomery gets his first. Yanks that one out of here. He's got a great swing, man. I'm loving Colson Montgomery early. Now here's perfect, perfect Josh Gibson. Perfect, perfect ground out Josh Gibson. Again, I'm a little bit too swing happy on the breaking balls down and away right now. Here's Ryan Howard. Nice backdoor slider right on the corner. Another ball hit hard foul by Ryan Howard. Hold that one foul. You're going to go here. Long at bat. Oh, we foul back ball four. That was a good slider. Oh, fair down the line. Ryan Howard, is it going to get all the way into the corner? It will. Will we try for two? We won't. We're going to go back. We might even be out. Oh, we're safe. All right. Two out single from Ryan Howard on a 10 pitch double digit at bat. That's insanity. Insanity. And then Dylan Cruz, one pitch, one out. <laughs> I got the exact pitch I wanted. I had to go swinging, but we just missed it. Solo shot for Colson Montgomery. A really good at bat from Ryan Howard. We have the lead. Let's get a zero. Opt it up. One out. Round ball to second base. Tony Stone gets in front of it. Takes it forehand. Okay. I was about to call a backhand snag from Tony Stone, but she got in front of it. Quick feet. Brings up Gary Sanchez. First pitch changeup. 1-0. Patient Gary Sanchez. That's a dangerous Gary Sanchez. Slider, 2-0. Jacob Mizorowski drawing the start here in the second game. Slider, staying away. He got that off the end of the bat. Hooks it all the way out to the warning track. Gary's got pop. James Wood smoked out the left, barreled up. That's going to get down for extra bases. It'll be at least a double. It will be a double, a leadoff double. James Wood. 
And now Tony Stone's going to pull out the left, the hanging slider. Taken off for third. But that ball was drawing him to center, and Cedric Mullins has a weak arm. I took off. We're up the third base now, but there's one out. It was a productive out from Tony Stone. Here's Adrian Beltre. That ball's laced to center. Get him on. Get him over. Get him in. Adrian Beltre, that will not hurt the batting average. A sacrifice fly to center field. Laced. Laced. Fly ball to right. That'll be the first out here to start the second. One pitch, one out on the slide. Swinging 3-0 with Mickey Mantle. I see you, big dog. We're running this whole lap bat right now. 3-1 cutter. Pops it up. Beautiful work. Got him geared up for a swing. Jammed him. Oh, just missed. Come on, Jacob. Brings up Beltra. He can tie it now one swing. What a take. Oh, one. Couldn't help himself. It's a fastball right down the middle. He didn't get all of it, though. James Wood's going to flag it down. That could have been bad. Buxton! Lead off front door slider was right down the middle, and Buxton goes 15 rows deep. 458 just below the scoreboard. Jeez. Launch month Buxton is different, man. Josh Gibson? Ah, see, I actually thought I got it that time, and the sound effect got me. 89 exit velo on that is garbage. Brings up Ryan Howard again, getting another righty in this game. I mean, that is a pretty good swing, man. Fastball up and away, and we smashed it. 108 on a line. I mean, just like, let my guy be great. Let him be great. He's hot. Let him stay hot. That ball should have been pooped on. Ground ball to first. Ryan Howard will scoop and snag. Pops it up. Three up, three down for Jacob. a boy. We're through three clean with Big Jake. Boo. Not the 101 ground out. All right, we're, we're just destroying ball. We're up three nothing. It's only the fourth. Well, we've had some loud outs, too. Get through. Nice play at first base. Can we beat it out? Oh, what a play. PFPs. Tony Stone now with a barrel, too. 93 off the bat. Oh, come on. <laughs> Not a bad inning. I mean, we've had four straight outs that were all pretty solid swings. They'll, it'll come. Ooh, swinging three up again. That's the second time this game he did that. He lines out. There. The line outs are just a thing right now. Nasty. Just three straight fastballs inside. Had them all ready to roll. Out in, front, out in front of a 95-mile-an-hour pitch. Ooh, three and one. Just going to go right at him. We got the multi-run lead. I don't want to put anybody on for free. Front door cutter. Ooh. Almost rolled that right on out there for him. But he flies out to left end the inning. Three up, three down again for Big Jake. Ripped. No, why is this happening right now? Spanked. Knock. But thankfully, thanks to a bad jump. Get up, get up. Two homer game for Buxton. Two homer game for Buxton. Launch month Buxton. Launch. Launch month Buxton. I never know when I got it or not with this Josh Gibson. <laughs> was all over it, but my timing was off. Sounded like a bazooka in the headphones. Routine fly out. Oh, boy. Wasn't even catchable. Get those arrows off my screen. First pitch curveball to Beltre, and he goes yarded. <laughs> it's a 5-2 ball game. Boy, Beltre got all that. Yay. Yee. All right. Cedric Mullins with the base hit. O2 base hit, might I add. Maybe we do got to get the bullpen going. Now, maybe Jacob Mizorowski isn't getting through and going deeper in this game like I thought. We're going to warm up Wagner and Classe. We'll hit a mound visit at front door cutter. Roll that over. Thank you. Flip it. Flip it. Oh, it just beat it out. Insane play by Coles of Montgomery again. Soft fly ball to right. Tony Stone should be there. She is. 
Gets two on two solo shots. Strands one. Four inning game here. We're up three. We got two full counts for Ryan Howard in this game. He's seen like 20 pitches. And he's going to rip that one into the gap. He's had two full counts. Nearly 20 pitches in total for the game. He's two for two. Get down, Cruz. Get down, Cruz. Get down, Cruz. Ah, I haven't had a bleeder since Nam. Check swing strikeout on James Wood. I just couldn't. Like, I definitely did press the button. Here's Tony Stone. Two outs, runner in scoring position. And Tony Stone goes perfect, perfect. Deep out to left. And that ball is gone. It's out of here. Tony Stone gets one out of here. Yes. The size difference between Tony Stone and Ryan Howard is hilarious. <laughs> Looks like father, daughter. But she gets it out of here. It's seven to two in the sixth. Get up, ball. No. Just disgusting. He was so late. No way. He got a sword mid at bat and then he gets a knock. Ew. Gary goes down. Here's Jose Abreu. I'd love a ground ball right now. I'd love a ground ball right now. 0 oh, and 2. Backdoor cut. Just gross. Oh, rolls it. Three. Six. Three double play. Beautiful. Votto hits it right at Ryan Howard. Spanked. Byron Buxton's having a ridiculous ball game. That's 10 total bases on the game right there. Just destroyed. 96 speed. I'm going to at least round, get that throw home. Move up to second with the hitter. Now we have second and third with one out here in the seventh, and we can blow this thing completely open now with Josh Gibson. Ground ball. Oh, he snatched it. <laughs> he had us at home, too. Buxton ran on contact. We would have been out. Now here's Ryan Howard. He's two for three. That got enough? Did he get enough? Chest high to Ryan Howard. That's not where you want to be with a four seam to Ryan Howard. We have hung a 10 spot on this man. Game two of the episode is going very well. We're up eight in the seventh. Got underneath of that one. The sinker never sunk because it was a four seam. Big inning. We need nine outs for a win. The like spam on this video, right? If you're still here right now this far and your thumbs that function very well have not gone down to hit that like button, let's do it right now. I bought a center. Good long at bat. There's been a lot of one pitch, one outs in the uh, to lead off at innings for this guy this game. Good long at bat there from Mickey, but we win the battle. Throw him off a little bit. He has not seen Class A well. We have him out there for a second inning right now. Backdoor cutter. He goes yard. All right, now he's starting to see him better. He got one barrel on him. I thought maybe, you know, he just ran into one. Now he's seeing him better now. Time to get Class A out of there. He's thrown enough pitches. He's pitched well. This is my fault. The second run is my fault. He's up to nearly 30. I got greedy. Gasoline, Johan Duran. Fly ball center. That was a splitter he wants back. Popped it up. One pitch, one out on Craig Biggio. Two down. Just missed. 3-0. Joey Votto on deck. I'm going to save Andrew Miller for Votto. We'll go right after Gary. We can just get Andrew Miller out there now. This way here, if he gets in any trouble, he's only got to face three. He's got the lefty on deck. Gary's actually got inverted. Splits, I'm pretty sure. And he swings 3-0 for like the fourth time this game and flies out to center. I don't think he has a single hit swinging 3-0 in this game. Could be wrong. Maybe one. It's probably a home. Doge? Lines out to lead off the ninth. Well, all right then. 10-4. Get out, ball. Too much air under it for Buxton. Almost his third homer of the game. Votto going to lead off the ninth now. Still got Andrew Miller out there. He can come out whenever we want him to, but I don't even have anyone warming up in the pen. We are going right after this guy. Lefty, lefty on Votto. 1-1. Oh, one, one. Ew. 1-2. One and two. On the pause. Yes. Really good slider. Ground ball to third. 3-2. Mano with back-to-back at-bats. He runs us long like that. Jeez. That was not a good pitch, but he's done so at this point. The boys are celebrating. That's another win. No money spent. 2-0 in today's video. Byron Buxton just went bananas. 
Two homers and a double. He's flipping bats, making plays in center field. He's our player of the game. We win it 10 to 4 on 12 hits. Smash that thumbs up down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Trying to get that big two at the front of the subscriber count. I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.